Hi Sagittarius, welcome back to my channel. This is going to be your next 48, January 5 and 6 for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. Okay, this is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node for Sagittarius. The Archer, January 5 and 6, 2022 for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, January 5 and 6. For Sagittarius, please, Spirit. What is the message is here for Sagittarius? Two of Pentacles. So things could be very, yeah, five of swords. So you can be like something is on and off or somebody's doing something to be petty or, or vindictive here. There's a lot of petty ass energy going on here. All right. So we get something, we got something that's unstable or something that's on and off or something that could be balanced. What's the Two of Pentacles for Sagittarius, January 5 and 6? January 5 and 6 for Sagittarius, yeah, Six of Cups. This is something, yeah, Five of Cups, something that's on and off, on again, off again relationship with someone. Could be someone from your past, a water sign, someone that you're familiar with that you possibly have kids with. I'm getting something's on and off with this person. Five of Cups, Nine of Swords, Eight of Swords, wow, and the Five of Wands. I'm getting you're very stuck in your head here, or you're very, or someone's losing sleep, or someone's very disappointed or sad, or somebody's just feeling fucked up here. I'm getting there's a lot of arguing and fighting with this person. If this isn't you feeling this way, this is this other person that you're dealing with. But with the Five of Swords, Nine of Swords, and Eight of Swords, this is a lot of stuck energy in your head, a lot of disappointment, a lot of regret. I'm just feeling very, very regretful here. This is you or someone else. Or maybe you're missing someone from your past or someone that you're familiar with. Yeah, the five of pentacles. I feel like somebody's ass is being left in the dust. It's what I'm hearing. Somebody's ass is being left behind. Someone is deciding to move forward or to move on with their life. And, and that may cause somebody to be in poverty or not to have shit, but I feel like, okay, somebody needs to get a job, either your ass or somebody else, if that's the situation. Somebody could also regret something that they said or did. They could regret neglecting someone. This could be an offering, yeah, the Ace of Cups, so new love. I feel like somebody's being left in the cold so that you can go towards someone else. I feel like, what's the Ace of Cups? I feel like there's someone new here. Or this is you. Yeah, Page of Swords, Knight of Pentacles, that you're watching very heavy here, Sagittarius, or that's watching you. Yeah, we have the Seven of Wands, but this person could have you blocked. I'm also getting like, yeah, the Tower, the High Priestess. I'm also getting like... Yeah, the Five of Wands. All right. And the Queen of Swords. So definitely a lot of arguing or fighting. Or, or there could be there could be you. There could be someone you're arguing and fighting with over someone that's online. What is the Five of Wands? For Sagittarius. I feel like there's there could be disputes or a lot of complaints. Maybe people are complaining because something's moving too slow. Or I don't know. Yeah, we have the Seven of Wands. I feel like you're blocking people or you just don't give a fuck or you're blocking this person that's trying to argue with you. Or you're leaving somebody on hold. I feel like somebody's getting left behind because there's somebody else that you'd rather be with or, some, or somebody you have on hold here. Or, or you're blocking out or ignoring these people that are trying to argue and fight with you or these disputes or whatever this is. I'm getting you're not you're not paying it no attention. Yeah. The page of wands, eight of wands. I get I'm getting a lot of um messages coming in, a lot of emails. Yeah, a lot of people wanting your services here. 
but I'm getting like there could be some disputes. Maybe maybe you took on more than you could handle, Sagittarius, with the Five of Wands. Now there's like maybe you're moving too slow, or now you don't want to do the work, or now you're bored, or you're just you're you're not yeah. I feel like you started something new with the Ace of Cups and it's really, really overwhelming. You're having to juggle a lot with the Two of Pentacles. You have a lot on your plate here that you're trying to handle. And I'm getting like, some people are feeling neglected or like you're moving too slow or like they're not getting what they asked for. So I'm getting disputes. Like people are complaining or they're disputing situations here. Okay. All right. Or people seem to think that you're moving too slow or whatever. Yeah, the Six of Pentacles. People are disputing their money or they want their money back or whatever this is. I'm also getting a lot of you being patronized as well. Yeah, a lot of payments coming in, a lot of money coming in for you. I'm getting you're going to have to stop or cut back on some of your clients or reject some people because you're overwhelmed. There's too much going on. You can't even handle what's on your plate. But I am getting a lot of being patronized here. Okay. Okay. Nine of Pentacles, Page of Cups. Okay. But I do see you, I do see you handling things here. We have the Six of Swords in the reverse. So going back in the Seven of Swords. Six of Swords, yeah, Seven of Swords in the Empress. The Two of Wands in the Tower, Four of Pentacles in the Two of Cups. I also feel like somebody's hiding how they feel about somebody. They're hiding their feelings or they're not being honest about how they feel. Yeah, the Eight of Cups. I feel like somebody, I feel like you walked away from a situation and then you are then, then you go back or you go back to a situation and you quickly walk away, you quickly neglect it or, or somebody wants you to come back, but you're not. I'm just getting on and on, on and off again with relationship between you and someone that you have kids with. I'm definitely getting the energy of somebody moving forward though like I, I feel like somebody's walking away emotionally i feel like you have to go back because um or you have to communicate with this person regarding kids or whatever this is but i feel like you're emotionally detached with the eight of cups we're going from the six to the eight so something wasn't fulfilling you're over the past you disconnected somebody feels left out in the cold or whatever this is This is you or someone else. Yeah, we have the Nine of Wands. Okay. I really feel like someone's trying to stop you from moving forward, but I'm getting it's not going to work. Yeah, this is Seven of Pentacles and the Hermit. I feel like this is someone you could have spent seven or eight years with. With this Seven right here. But I feel like it's over. Or I feel like something that you put a lot of years or effort or time or money into did not give you what you wanted. I feel like you feel like you're walking away from a situation empty handed or that you gave more to a situation than you got or that somebody's just really in, unstable. They're in and out of your life or they or there's always arguments and fights and shit. Yeah, this is you, Sagittarius. We got the nine of wands and the knight of wands. So I feel like you're very frustrated, irritated with this person. I feel like you, you're emotionally detached, but you feel like you always have to go back or you always have to, yeah, because there's a child involved with the page of wands. You have to communicate regarding this child and every, if something always turns into an argument. You can't, you don't get along with this person or you guys can't seem to be on the same page about a situation here. Yeah, the devil card. I'm getting, you're just very frustrated. We have the devil, the ace of pentacles, the knight of cups, the justice. The nine of pentacles yeah i feel like you just rather be single i feel like you're frustrated you're single you're happy to be single you're happy to be on your own you're happy to be handling to 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 be so you have a sun card i said happy and there it is i feel like you're happy being single or happy traveling or happily or or happy by yourself here i feel like you're happy doing something by yourself here Yeah, the Three of Swords. Yeah, that's the truth. Ace of Swords. 
and I feel like there's an ex or somebody that's heartbroken or sad that just keeps trying to pull you in or get you to come back but or or get you to argue with them or dispute or whatever the fuck this is. And I'm getting you're just not going to do it. You're just going to move forward. This could also be something about child support. Okay, yeah, the high one. I'm also getting something about a check or some kind of payment or money that you may have had a dispute with this government institution with the higher font. I'm getting things that are going to go in your favor because the Ace of Swords just is feeling like a check to me. I feel like you're frustrated about something about your money, but you're going to get what you want. The sun card, a solution to all your problems. You're getting what you want or you're getting this money. I'm getting something with $600 short or I don't know. But I'm getting with the Ten of Cups, you, you end up happy. You end up getting what you want. Yeah, Ten of Cups and the Sun card. There's also somebody here, I feel like, that you kind of miss here, Sagittarius, or that misses you, that you want to apologize to. I feel like this person is your happiness or you or you want to give to this person or date this person or message this person you may be reaching out to someone Sagittarius or someone may be trying to reach out to you this person could have blocked you or maybe this person left you on red or you're worried about that happening Yeah, I feel like there's somebody that's very attracted to you, Sagittarius. So this is you. I feel like you're leaving the past behind. I feel like every time you walk away, though, that you, you end up going back or returning. Or you end up feeling stuck or somebody tries to suck you back in or pull you back in. But I'm getting you, you you're moved on. Your back is turned. I feel, I feel like this person from your past irritates you or frustrates you or get on your fucking nerves about this child or about money. Somebody always needs money or you're always having to give somebody something because somebody else could be like in poverty or they're not doing well financially or maybe somebody can't help you or whatever the fuck this is. I'm just getting you. There is a nine of pentacles energy. Somebody very self-sufficient. Very There could be a business owner, somebody that's very reliable, reliable somebody that's, that's self-made. that you're very, very much attracted to, that makes you very happy here. You may even want to commit to or apologize to. I feel like you miss this person. Maybe you lied or you said something fucked up or whatever happened here. I feel like you want to apologize. I'm also getting that you're frustrated. Somebody just keeps trying to have sex with you or suck you back in and you do not want this person or they don't want your ass, Sagittarius. You know what side it is you want. Yeah, the seven of swords and the three of wands. Yeah, we have the justice here. The eight of swords. I'm also getting about something about someone getting locked up. I'm also getting like somebody's trying to, yeah, we have the devil, the the moon, the five of cups, and the, and the empress, and the four swords, heavy Libra energy. So there's somebody that's regretful, that's missing you here, or you're missing. I'm getting fears around something. I feel like you really want to smooth something over. Yeah, the judgment card. I'm getting a reconciliation. I'm getting you want to reach out to somebody, smooth something over, add somebody out, or date someone, or send something. I'm getting a lot of payments as to cash at Vimo, or, or however this is you're getting paid here. 
however this is you're getting paid i feel like um yeah we have the ace of wands something new the two aces here well three aces so i feel like a lot of new beginnings here What is this? Oh, and then the fourth ace. So a lot of new opportunities here. A lot. What is this ten of swords? What is this ten of swords right here? Yeah, the nine of cups. I'm getting like somebody wants to, to heal the situation with this ten of swords that wanted to come out in the reverse. Somebody wants to heal this betrayer or somebody wants to come out. I just feel like somebody wants to return back to somebody that they that they walked away from. Someone's walking away from their past, it seems like. But I feel like somebody wants to return to someone else here. Yeah, the six of wands. I'm really getting dating. You could be dating someone here, going out, maybe drinks, fun. Or this is what you want with someone, Sagittarius. But I feel like you could have betrayed this person or they did it to you. You know which side of this you're on. So there's a, a little bit of fears about moving things forward or going towards this person or, or apologizing. Five of Cups, yeah, regret. Someone's in regret here or remorseful about something that happened here. I feel like it's a choice. You have the two of swords. Someone regrets not making a decision or sitting on the fish. Yeah, there are two of wands or making a wrong decision. Somebody wishes that they would have chose a different path is what I'm really, really getting. Yeah, somebody spends a lot of time. We got Virgo energy here, Leo energy here. Okay. Taurus. Virgo, Leo, and Taurus. There's a lot. There's a lot more court cards than there is major arcana. So I just feel like there's a lot going on here. But nothing is permanent. I feel like something's going to change here. Oh yeah, the Wheel of Fortune. I feel like there's going to be a huge shift here in the situation here. I feel like you're really focused on your happiness or on your business or moving something forward for yourself. I said your business, and the Emperor came out. We have the six of wands and the fool. So I'm getting new beginnings, starting things, starting something new here. Working on your business or working on your following. Or yeah, the ten of wands. Really putting in work. I feel like there's a lot on you, a lot of stress. I feel like you're going to have to drop something here and walk away. Or I feel like you took on more than you can handle. Yeah, we have the moon and the eight of swords. I also, I'm, I'm definitely getting something about being in your head or night sweats. Or feeling stuck here or overwhelmed. Really thinking about something here. What's the moon in the Eight of Swords? I feel, like, I feel like you're really, yeah, the Queen of Wands. So you're really in your head about this Queen of Wands energy. This Nine of Pentacles energy. Or they are about you, Sagittarius. I feel like a lot of, you spend a lot of time thinking about this person, especially at night. I feel like you want to start over or a new beginning here. You regret how something turned out. You regret something you said or you or you really miss this person. I feel like someone is very popular. Someone does very well for themselves. Somebody has built an empire. Somebody is self-made. You're really watching this person. You're very attracted to them. Someone could be very skinny, very fit. They smell good. They look good. They're self-made. They're very beautiful. Someone has very radiant skin as well. Someone has beautiful skin. I feel like you really want to date or be in this person's energy. You really miss this person. And I feel like you're letting go of or, or you're really frustrated with this person from your past that keeps trying to pull you in. I'm getting somebody else going to be left out in the cold. I'm getting you completely closed off to this person. You do not trust someone here. And I feel like it's this person from your past with the six of cups that you have a child with. I feel like somebody else is being left out in the cold. Yeah, the tower. I feel like you really want to reconcile with someone here. Yeah, the seven of pentacles in the reverse. I feel like you're no longer investing time or energy into someone, Sagittarius. Just period. Yeah, we have the lovers. I feel like you're annoyed. I feel like someone keeps trying to get you to have sex with them as well, and you do not want to. You do not want to have sex with this person at all. You're not attracted to them, or you don't fucking want they ass. I feel like somebody is really irritating your fucking soul. 
and you really just want somebody to leave you the fuck alone. Yeah, yeah, the Ten of Wands. I'm getting you're dropping a lot of burdens here or a lot of people or a lot of these responsibilities that ain't got shit to do with you. I feel like you're struggling. You're, you're juggling a lot trying to take care of somebody else that need to get their grown ass off their raggedy ass and take care of their motherfucking self. I feel like you're attracted to this Nine of Pentacles energy, somebody that's doing for themselves, somebody that, that runs their own business, someone very popular. This could be online. I'm also getting gaining a following here. I'm getting you block someone. All somebody wants to do is argue and fight, especially about money. I'm getting you're blocking someone or you've blocked them because you don't want to hear that shit. Yeah, the King of Cups and the Empress and the Justice. Somebody could be a double Libra. We have the Magician, the Ten of Pentacles and the Three of Cups. I feel like a Libra is significant here. You're very popular. You're making a nine of swords, five of swords. I feel like somebody's regretful for playing mind games or being petty or whatever this is. I feel like somebody's regretting something. Now they want to apologize. You have the temperance. That's you, Sagittarius. I feel like you want to balance something out in the will of fortune. I feel like a shift is going to happen. Yep, in the two of cups. The hangman, the empress, the justice. I feel like there's going to be reconciliation. You're taking major action towards this Libra or this Pisces or whoever it is. I feel like a huge shift is happening here. I also feel like in your money as well. Or this is someone else. But whatever it is, I feel like there's going to be a change or a shift here in who you're wanting to be with. I feel like... You just want to be with somebody you feel an emotional attachment with, somebody that you feel like you can trust. And I feel like it's this person from the past. You don't trust them. Yeah, the death card is over. Two, two, two on the clock. Yeah, the devil. What is the devil card? I feel like you're leaving toxicity behind. I feel like you just want a more peaceful coexistence and you just don't have it with this person or whoever this is. Yeah, the four of cups. I feel like you're very discontent and you're very over this devil. I feel like you just don't trust somebody. Somebody frustrates you, even hearing their voice. I feel like you do everything in your power to avoid someone. But there's children involved. I feel like your main focus is moving towards this other person that you want to be with. I feel like you're bored or you're over having sex with multiple people. It's unfulfilling. And so you're deciding to move ahead with someone. Yeah, King of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles. You want to apologize or prove something to someone? Yeah, the High Priestess, the Four of Wands in the world. This could be somebody on the world stage. Yep, and the Star card, the Three of Cups. A celebrity, somebody that is a star in the public eye or an influencer. I feel like you want to prove yourself to this person or you want to do right by this person. I feel like that's your main focus, not the drama, the fuck shit, these people or nothing. I feel like you're leaving that shit behind. And anybody that ain't on the same wave as you, that ain't adding to what it is you're trying to do, they ass is being left behind, just period. We have the star card, the queen of pentacles, yes. The two of cups and the hangman, nine of swords. You're going towards this influencer, just period. This business owner, this entrepreneur, someone that's doing very well for themselves. I feel like you want to work with or collab with this person. And there's going to be an apology or a letter or a long message or email that's being written to someone or someone's going to ask someone out on a date or something like that to talk about a situation or to heal it. So those are your messages. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.